it's me back again in my mom's home office we gotta stop meeting up like this you guys so we're just gonna jump right into it i've already cleansed my face so as you can see my dry skin i kind of start getting drier right here but also i shaved so i mean you're welcome but today we're almost done with mass of may or at least the mass that i have time to show this is absolutely one of my favorite masks of all time especially since i have such dry skin from fresh this is the rose face mask apply to cleansed damp skin I've literally never done that. I've always put it on dry skin, so like, wow. Today we're gonna do it right. I have this little tool, I got it from Amazon. It's a continuous spray bottle, so you press it down, you hold it, and then it like keeps spraying, so like, so cool. I use it for my hair though. Um, yeah, so this mask, it basically, it's claims, or that it's going to soothe and tone. I really find that it just super hydrates my skin. So, let's open it up and see what it looks like on the inside. As we can see, there are rose petals in there. It smells amazing. The mask actually has a really cooling texture. So, since today is a treat myself day, we are gonna apply this mask not with our hands, not with our fingers, but with an Artiste Elite brush. This is their Oval 7. I first saw this method of application from a great YouTuber named Tiff Benson. She used her Artiste brush to apply and it just looked like such luxury that I really wanted in my life. So, you know, that's what we're gonna do today. So this brush is like super soft. It's very, it's a, it's a, it's a splurge. So, here we go, pan face, brush, I'm gonna dip it in. Love the texture of this mask and how it applies. And it's such a cooling sensation that my skin just loves. I don't even know if I'm still in frame. But I really like to make sure, of course, putting on like an even layer, but I go ham in my areas that get super dry. Like ham. All right. This is not necessarily how one avoids the eyebrows, but. But yeah, this mask in the morning, iconic. Mine's running really, really low, so I'll have to re-up. I think that looks good. So. <sighs> Smells amazing, feels so soothing. I feel like it's more of like a psychological soothing effect because I very much am like, let's move that mirror over here. I very much am like, mentally calmer so for like five to ten minutes what the mask says so i'm probably gonna do like 10 minutes the super super cool thing about this mask is that it's almost like 
when, like once you wash it off or rinse it off, I feel almost like a, a very, like the cool texture of the mask almost is still on my face as I continue with the rest of my skincare routine and I'm obsessed with that. But yeah, um, I'm pretty sure Ortiz brushes are mostly for makeup. But I went ahead and got their cleansing pad and their brush cleaning foam. So I'm going to go ahead and, and here's a foam. So, um, press down, dispense foam into the fiber bundle of the brush or onto the micro cloth. So, yeah. I'm just gonna demo this. So I put like that amount, uh, blah, 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 that much, that amount, words. So I take this and then with the dirty brush, I kind of just go like that to make sure that there's no, hopefully that there's no bacteria that gets left over. I just like to rub it, rub it, rub it, ASMR. And then you just kind of let it air dry. And then it's nice and fresh and clean and ready for you. So, I am going to just relax, chill, and enjoy this mask. And then I'll be back, like I'll rinse it. And then I'll be back with like my final thoughts and whatnot. So I'm petting my face with this dishcloth that I knit. It's 100% cotton and it's a super soft yarn. It's a dishcloth, but like it's just a cloth like this. I can do different patterns in it. And you know, I don't do dishes. So I make the dishcloth for people who do dishes or for people who want to dry their face with it. And yeah, so that one's mine. These are our results. My skin feels very smooth and like really hydrated. Um, I love this mask, it's from Fresh. I actually really love their brand of products. I use a few of them in my routine hopefully i'll be able to like make some videos and post some about my thoughts on those products but this mask it's very i find it super hydrating of course there are probably other products that do this same thing for cheaper and like but you know i just really love the product and experience so in the brand so i'll support them but um yeah they have smaller sizes of this for people who like either want to travel or give it as a gift or want to try before they commit to like this full size but this one's the full size one it's 100 mil and typically if i'm like not doing this every single week um then it could last me a pretty long time um this one, in fact, since I've been getting into other masks, I, I, it's lasted me a pretty long time, like two or three months. Um, so yeah. I don't know what else to say. I have no qualms with this mask. Um, I'm ready to hop into the rest of my skincare routine, which includes, you know, a lot of hydrating products. Hyaluronic acid is one of them. Um, and some serums, lotions and potions, and then finishing it off with a sunscreen and reapplying the sunscreen as we should all 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 be doing but yeah y'all know all my links are below if you want to chat skincare or dancing or knitting or any of that stuff uh thanks for watching if you watched this far bye see you all later with some more content